Our main objective for today is to catch some rock bass. And I know that there is a healthy population of them in this lake. And we're going to be targeting them using this. This is a tiny, mini, ultralight, micro, whatever you want to call it, wacky rig. This is the Berkeley Power Bait Trout Worm on a tiny size 4 hook. It sinks very slowly. A lot of the times these rock bass are just like right here, right in the rocks, as their name suggests. First fish, and there it is. That is what we're going after. This is a tiny little rock bass. You can see they got red eyes, big old mouth. Hopefully we'll, we'll catch some bigger than this. There's one. Oh, he came off. No. He was a bigger one. <laughs> there we go. A little largemouth on the wacky rig. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Getting hooked. We'll see if anything's by this cliff face right here, and then we'll probably f start fishing back. Just a quick trip today, quick morning trip. There's one. There we go. That's a bigger rock bass. There we go. Nice rock bass on the wacky rig. He held true to his name. He was right by the rocks. The rock bass. Nice. So we're switching it up a little bit. I put on this uh, Leland Lores trout magnet jig head. I think it's a 132nd ounce, just so I can fish a little bit faster. Um, the bear hook is probably a better presentation for these fish, but I just want to cover more water, get the deeper water, and fish more efficiently. Also switch to the white worm. We'll see if that makes a difference. Caught a bag. That's pretty cool, right? All right, this area looks better for rock bass. This is the first area we were fishing. It's a lot more rocky. What is that? It's a fish right there taking it. That's a bigger one. What is that? That's a big old bluegill. Is a chonker. Man, that is a chonker. Holy, that is pretty good bluegill right there. He was a thick boy. There's a 
big rock bass. Nice. That is pretty nice rock bass right there. Got him on that white wacky rig with the little trout magnet jig head. He was just sitting right on the rock, right by the shoreline. Nice. Let this guy go. He just swam right back under into the rock. That's funny. All right, successful little fishing trip here. Caught three rock bass, a large mouth, and two bluegill. So pretty good. I was only fishing for, I don't know. I've been here two hours, probably only fished like an hour. It was like filming and moving and stuff. So it's pretty good. Um, the action of the wacky rig looked good with and without the jig head. So probably if I use it in the future, I'd probably just use the jig head just so I can fish a little bit faster. But if you want to go more finesse, use the bear hook. It's got great action. <laughs>